Okay, now I'd like to add an input form and a CTA so a user can actually like join uh, this community. So let's go to Import Forms and we'll choose uh, Input. So you just draw it in the group. So here you, you see, whenever you are going to um, add an element to a group, you will see uh, a red uh, square around, uh, like defining where is the group. So here I'm adding the input inside the group. Uh, here this input will be for the user to put his email address. So let's put input email address. And uh, we'll have to define what is the content format here. Uh, the content format will be an email. So we are going to collect an email, so we can choose email. Uh, note that uh, there are several content formats, so you need to choose the one which is suitable to your needs. So here it's email. And we are going to make it uh, a little smaller. And we want the user to be able to click on a button to input uh, his or her email. So I choose, I go at the top and in visual elements, I choose button. And I draw it and I change the name, uh, join now. And let's edit the style. Let's make it a little bit more pretty. Okay, and let's put the same font as everywhere. Okay better. Uh, you can also change the style, for example here, uh, if you don't want like rounded corners, you can totally like change the style. You have roundness, for example, here I put zero, here if I want to do the same, roundness zero. And here, um, maybe I'd like to, to group these two elements together because they, they belong together. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to select both and group these elements in a group. So it will be a smaller group and uh, let's put like group uh, join now, for example. Great. And you, in, you will now see in the elements tree that the group join now is under the group main header. Great.